Hey, what's up guys? So this week is how to, and I decided for my video I'm going to do how to carve a pumpkin. There's only a couple things that you'll need. One of them is a the pumpkin. You need a knife. You need a pot or a bucket to put the pumpkin guts in. And then some kind of stencil or pattern that you want to cut into your pumpkin. For my pumpkin today, we're just going to do a Batman symbol because it's pretty easy. We're not going to get too complex here, kids. So what I'm going to do is take a little marker and draw my Batman symbol on the pumpkin. All right, so we got a bat symbol on there. Like it? How's it look? So now's the fun part. We got to get all the insides on the outside. So we're going to cut around the top part, but you want to make sure. Oh, this is going to be hard. The knife goes all the way through. These knives are horrible. By the way, you can watch the video of me picking the pumpkin that I'm carving right now over on my channel. Ugh. Gross. Now you have to put your hand inside and scoop out all of the gross stuff. This kind of smells awful. So while we're doing this, I guess I can talk to the other guys and say that the first week of videos was so much fun and I'm more than thrilled to be back on this channel, even if it's just for a month. I obviously never was on the channel when Michael was on, so it's a lot of fun to be working with him this month. All of his videos are so great, and he has such an amazing job. I'm super jealous of all the shows that he's gotten to work on. And of course, it's great seeing Corey, and I hope you feel better. I know being sick sucks. I've been sick the past couple of days, so hopefully you feel better soon. Even when you're sick, you're staying cute. And Johnny, you're another one that I never got to work with on the channel, so it's been a lot of fun getting to talk to you and getting to know you a lot more. Your 30 second recap was pretty intense. You've done a lot of like life-changing things the past couple of years. And Steven, I am so glad that you decided to come back and do this reunion with all of us and with me. And I really hope that your how-to video tomorrow is the sex ed class because your vagina story cracked everybody up. And the viewers have been amazing. Your comments have been so great and fun to read. And it's crazy how many of you I remember from five years ago. Now, I don't know if you can see, but there's all kinds of like stringy things inside. So I'm gonna, oh, I smudged my pattern. So I'm gonna take a spoon and just scrape all that stuff out. But back to talking about the viewers. I know that the five of us have had so much fun reading everybody's comments. And we're going to have to have some viewer participation in one of our videos coming up soon. So I'm going to post everybody's Twitter feed, Twitter links below. And make sure that you're following all of us because, like I said, we are going to need your help coming up soon. So now that we have successfully gotten all of the guts out of the pumpkin, we can go ahead and trace our little pattern. This part is going to suck because we've already discovered that this knife is horrible. But we're going to make it work. So basically, you just cut out the pattern with your knife. Worst. Now I remember why I just painted pumpkin last year. <sighs> so once you've carved out the whole pattern, it should just pop right out. And it's kind of, where is it stuck? Oh, down here. Yay! We're gonna take a little tea tree light and put it right in the middle. Light it on fire. Then put the top of the pumpkin back on. Kill the lights! Ooh la la. So there you have it. That is how you carve a pumpkin. We will see Stevie tomorrow and until next week, peace.